All right, so we have one of the coolest cars on the planet, a Dodge Avenger. Just kidding, not the coolest car on the planet, but definitely we're gonna avenge this car by getting it completely cleaned up because if you look at this thing, I mean, it's it's just full of garbage. Like, it's crazy that this car was traded in just like this, and we're gonna be restoring it. We're gonna return it back to new. You guys are gonna be blown away by the end results, so stick around and subscribe if you are new. Hit that subscribe button right now, guys. Do it. Do it. Once I uncovered this brown stuff underneath the banana peels and stuff, I, I really don't know what it is, but this is where the odor of this car was centralized from all of this trash back here. And with the seats out, you get to see all of the goodies that are lying underneath. Um, and that's why we're gonna hit the vacuuming first. Get all this crap vacuumed up, get as much of it removed, so that way we can get a good idea of how much work we have when it comes to the extraction phase. Now with all this vacuuming finished up, we're gonna get the drill brush out and start getting all that white salt removed. Um, first, gonna hit it dry, and then we're going to be uh, spraying on our carpet solution to break it up even further before the extraction takes care of it. Um, but you can pick up those drill brushes at foxclean.com, guys. Okay, so when it comes to extraction, you can kind of see how you have the center console up top on the screen. This is the rear passenger area. It's a very, very big common place where like if coffee gets spilled or a drink gets spilled, it puddles around these seat brackets and the carpet in this area. So 
enjoy these extractor shots because this is the juiciest of all of the cleaning of the carpets and the seats right here in this one little segment. I always get asked about taking things apart in the car. How do I know how to do it, blah, blah, blah. It's kind of just by feel and from experience. But I will say whenever it comes to taking seats out of a rear bench in a, a sedan, it's the trickiest thing ever because sometimes you can't see the bolts. You have to take all of the trim panels in the trunk out to even get to some of them. That's why a lot of the times if it's easy to do, I'll pull them out. But these ones weren't super dirty, so it wasn't absolutely necessary. Um, and that's why they kind of stayed in the car for this particular detail. Um, hot chocolate, anyone?
Now when it comes to extraction, the biggest thing that I recommend is you do a pass after you've sprayed on all of your cleaning solution, use a drill brush, use your extractor just to suck up that solution. That's why this dirty shots that you're seeing here with the extractor head are so nasty looking because there's no extra fluid injecting in, causing that dirt to seep in deeper. It's just soaking up all of the dirt on the surface after using the drill brush. So that is one thing to get all that heavy, dirty stuff on the surface removed before you start injecting um, cleaning solution again with the extractor head. Um, so the first pass is always just remove that top surface dirt. Now the big thing with interior panels is always use compressed air if you have it available to blow out any dust or dirt or dog hair for that matter in this case. And then we're gonna be using the steam cleaner to blow out all those seams and get any of that goo stuff that's in all those switches dislodged before we follow with the APC to do the final clean to make sure this door panel looks absolutely mint.
A lot of you have asked me about car flipping, and that is why I'm announcing Car Flipping 101 course is live. It's been live, I announced it in last week's video, so if you missed it, definitely check it out in the description box below. It's a course that I've created with all of my knowledge on how to flip cars and make profit. All of you probably would love to make some extra money on the side or full time. This course will tell you all of my secrets on how I find, source, flip these cars, and make money. So if you wanna check it out, link in the description box below.